Hi, this is a video on what to expect when you get your new VO camera in the mail. We've had ours since it first shipped to the US in 2019, and we share our tips and lessons learned during that time in a VO field guide that you can get at easysoccervideo.com. Congrats on your new camera, and hope this video is helpful. Hi, this is Ben from easysoccervideo.com. And I wanted to show you what to expect when you first uh, get your VO camera delivered. We just ordered, uh, got our second camera in, and um, actually uh, I'll put it up side by side here with our, with our kind of our first camera. Um, do a little comparison um, as we go. But when you first get um, the case, this is kind of you know it's a nice protective case, carrying case. Um, Looks, it comes with uh, two different guides, getting started and then using it every day. Um, it comes with some adapters based on what part of the world you live in. So here, um, the one that I need is for the US. And then you have the charging cable and you simply slide this piece onto the appropriate place in on the here and then you can use this to then charge your camera this is the unit itself this is a newer um, version I can actually show you the original one that we first um, started using looks a little different so this is you can tell this is a newer one um, it's a little different too in that a lot of the um, Things you need to access are actually on the bottom of the camera and as opposed to the top of the camera. So you can, the original version had them here in the, um, kind of in the back and the new version has them on the bottom. So it's kind of cool to see that VO is actually, um, they're, they're really good at listening to feedback and making adjustments. Um, so it's pretty cool that, um, that they are willing to listen to the customers and make improvements. Um, Let's see here. So one of the things I was gonna also going to show you was th this piece here. Um, when I got this first one, it wasn't actually screwed in, but now it comes screwed in. It's screwed into the bottom. And this um, is also comes with, underneath it, this is the part that attaches to the top of your tripod. So this screws on to the top of the tripod. And then this quick release plate then snaps into the camera. At the bottom of the camera, so then that is what holds it onto the uh, onto the tripod. One of the things, oh, it also comes with. Uh, so this is the Ethernet cord that you use then to plug it in. One thing to, to note is that on this newer one, on this side here, you don't want to open this. This is just for the power and the light. On this one, um, on this side is where you open it up to access. This is where you charge the camera. And this is where you plug in the Ethernet. Um, you plug it into your network. If you use um, get one of the adapters, it can also let you use your camera with an existing tripod. Um, when you buy a VO camera, you can purchase one of their tripods. But if you already have a tripod and you get an adapter, then you can uh, simply screw the adapter onto the top of the tripod. And then this part here screws into the bottom of this. So you can actually um, use different tripods. Um, if, you already, if you already have a tripod, you can use it with your camera. So um, you wanna make sure you keep this closed um, to keep, keep the moisture out. So as part of the um, package, it comes with these two guides, um, start here and everyday use. So the start here, Kind of lets you know how to get everything up and running. Um, sometimes it's a little confusing for people, so make sure you read, you know, follow the instructions. It tells you basically what you do is you first thing you do when you get it is you charge the camera, um, plug the camera into the internet with the Ethernet cable, um, and then you once it's on, you'll be able to with your device connect to the Wi-Fi um, that it, the the network that it shows up in your, your Wi-Fi settings. Once you turn the camera on, it shows you how to create your account, register your camera, 
It also shows you, as I was saying, there's the, the tripod, the quick release, and how you put it on the top of the tripod. Um, you know, like I'm not, as, I, as I mentioned, if you have another tripod that you want to use, you can always use the adapter and then use an existing tripod. And then the everyday use talks more about um, setting it up on the field and how you prepare to record what it looks like on game day um, and how you know that the, the camera is recording. And then also last um, but not least, how you upload the, the, the footage once you've recorded it. So um, that's a quick overview of what you will expect to see when you get your, your new VO camera in the mail and getting it set up. And as I, as I mentioned, it's cool to see the company is um, continuing to innovate and listen to customers. And we've been really happy with our VO camera. And if you have questions about um, the setup or we've actually put together a, a VO field guide for kind of tips about how we use it for um, pr games and practices and for for coaches and for managers and for players. So um, we'll, we'll put a link to that below. So hopefully this was helpful to um, to you if you're considering getting a VO camera or if you already have one. And for more info on the camera, you can go to easysoccervideo.com. Thanks.